Yeah. What's going on? Like, all right. Who cares you know the star of the pod is like uh, <laughs> <laughs> Levi. <laughs> Levi. All right, Ray. Well, you got to count us in. All right, boys. In five, four, three. Welcome back, people, coast to coast, all you millions, and I mean millions, of IBL fans out there. This is Bush Banta coming to you live. I am G Hill. How you doing, folks? I'm going to pass it on to my cousin Hagers. Are you here? No, I'm here. Cheers. Elliot, you in the building? I'm in the building. Good to be here. And I'll finally pass it on to the newest father, our other Bush brethren. Ray, are you here? I am here, gentlemen. I'm taking a day off, so I'm having a soda water. Got a new son in the building. So we got to keep it clean today. Sorry, exactly. fans. I'm sorry. Exactly. Here's so, yeah, boys. obviously. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Salute. Welcome, welcome to Bush Banter, thank obviously. Thank you. Thank but you. But before that, before that, and salute to Ray, as we mentioned, people, Ray just, you know, Ray and the beautiful Queen Carrie, Bush Lady of the Year, just brought in a very healthy baby into the world. Levi, I think he was, what well, he said, seven pounds, seven ounces. But seven pounds, you actually would ounces. know the best because I think you weighed him yourself because, Ray, like, how did this all go down? Why don't you tell us oh. about your day that your son was born? All right, gentlemen. Well, it started off like a regular old Sunday. Me just getting fired up for the London majors to come to town. Oh, my God, I was ready. So, basically, I had this whole thing scheduled to make 24 sandwiches for the boys. Had all the meats from the Sillies lined up. I had the buns lined up. I was going down to my dad's at nine o'clock. We were going to slap together all the Sammies. I'll pause you there. I can so, verify this was happening because I was texting Ray in the morning and at 830, I got a picture from him with his dad. Shout out Papa Noel making sandwiches. And Ray goes, I'm making sandwiches for the boys. So, okay, Ray, continue on. You're making I had 11 o'clock. Okay. So basically I got up and Carrie was in, in the room and she was like, ah, I haven't really slept last night. I think maybe something might be happening. So like, don't worry about it. Just go make the sandwiches, get that dropped off, but come back, try and be back like around 12. Cause supportive. Go make, the sandwiches. Be kind of, go make yeah, sure the boys it. are fed. She knew it. She knew it. She wanted She's the boys a true to be bush fed. lady. She knew, She's a, she knew oh. what was going on and all, she didn't really want to like kind of start to panic. She didn't tell me this till later, but she kind of also thought that maybe it was like the start of labor and we would maybe have 24 hours and have to go and check into the hospital and do that whole rigmarole because we were kind of he's he was due at the end of next week so we're getting into the go time and uh so anyways like i went down to dad's not really thinking much about it kind of telling dad all right like Stuff's kind of starting, so it could be maybe today or tomorrow, but you better be coming to the game. And my brother was in the other room, too, and I was like, you better be coming to the game today. <laughs> Thinking that I would just, you know, get back and maybe it was like a passing kind of cramp or morning. I don't know. But anything, all, all was well. We finished up the sandwiches. I, I, I was talking to Tops. I had between 11 and 11.30 to get them there. Boys needed to hammer those down and be ready for the game at two. Yeah. So I was on a tight schedule, you know? <laughs> Made it there, 11.30, had a quick second to top the tops, and, you know, just chopped it up. Knew I stayed probably a little bit too long, but that's all right. <laughs> we'll deal with that later. <laughs> then I made a quick We definitely Sunday. left there at like 12. Man, yeah. come on. It was great. It was finally like a chance to chop, talk shop, you know? So dropped the sandwiches off. All was well. Went to shoppers just to get a couple things because you're supposed to bring like a overnight bag of snacks when you go to the hospital. So I was like, all right, I'll stop now. And, and at this point, you're full well thinking, yeah, yeah, okay. I'm, I'm thinking, you know, I'm going to go to the game. Right Everything's going to be normal. I have a week. So basically, right. I get the stuff. I get a couple bags. I get home, and Carrie is on, like, 
her knees and she's just on the bed, her head like on the bed like this. And she has the phone right beside her and she's talking to the midwife. She's like, I think I'm in a contraction right now. Like, <laughs> and the midwife's like, okay, just like calm down. I think I'm going to plan to come over right now. So this is literally right when I like get in the door and she's just like breathing through it kind of focusing like the midwife is like okay like i think something's happening so i'm gonna come and check so midwife says but i'm gonna be 45 minutes so for that next 45 minutes i was basically just rubbing and making sure carrie was amazing and she was amazing like it was crazy midwife got here 45 minutes later this is now probably around like two o'clock Game's just starting, kind of pissed, but kind of excited for what's going on. Next thing I know, the midwife checks Carrie, and she's 10 centimeters dilated, which basically means the baby is, like, coming right now. So she looks at the two of us, and she's like, what do you guys want to do? Do you want to do this right here, or do you want to go to the hospital? We're like, Oh my God, like, I guess we'll do it right here. She just like, went for it. But like, you got the plastic sheet for the home birth? We're like, no, we don't have the plastic sheet for the home birth. She's like, all right, I'm going to need some towels, a bucket of cold water. Like, let's go. And dude, it was wild. It was a crazy experience. He was literally wow. born at 345, right at the end of the game. Wow. Jesus. Lazo wow. gets the well, win. No, we're not ready right at wow. the end of the game. The IBL game takes a few more hours. He was born, <laughs> yeah. He guessed he was born when Justin Mara hit that go-ahead team. I think shot. when he hit the go-ahead shot, yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. But then Lazo closed it out for the baby. Oh my God. Well, it was wow. That's, uh, that is wild. That is, that is the, the longest but craziest intro on Bush Banter you'll That's ever it. hear. How about that for a Sunday? Wow. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, I think, wow. I think the top Cheers, it off, Ray and Carrie, JP's, JP's tweet was the greatest thing ever. He was like, hey, guys. Wow. You remember that day that Ray made sandwiches for the Leafs and went home out of baby and the Leafs won? Yeah. That's great. <laughs> oh, wow. A bush baby. A it bush should, baby. It should be That's noted, it. too, that Ray's fandom thrives in all pressure situations because he let us know we had a baby and then asked us the score. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and, and yes, yeah, so, yeah, we did. We let all the boys know. Everyone wished you – Obviously, you, carry and, and Levi, he's very healthy. Uh, all the he's best. Healthy. You did get a shout-out from Lazo. He made a little clip Loved for it. you. I don't Loved know if you it. saw that. You I want did. to change it the baby's great. name to Salazo? Like, it's it's up to you. But, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, wow, what a story. What a story. <laughs> Well, let's let's get into the banter. Well, like that was that was awesome. Uh, I guess to, just to recap, obviously uh, the the Leafs, you know, the weekend before because this is, gets filmed later. Uh, we played Hamilton. Uh, the boys weren't there in Hamilton. Leafs lost four zip. Uh, Chris Lazar ended up pitching a nine innings pitch shutout, complete game. Yeah, unreal. Unreal. They had a couple bloopy singles to get runs. I know I saw you boys on the chatter. I think you were watching it or, or listening to it or tracking to it. Man, I, I was tracking there. Point was... Street, Point man. That's yeah. the only way to watch IBL games. It. It's vintage. <laughs> oh, and Andrew Hyde battled that game for his first IBL start. You know, I think he won in like four or five innings. He went, yeah. He went five innings, six hits, gave up three earned runs with three walks and two K. So it was for his first start. You know, Not Andrew, bad. we respect it. He came in relief the game four. And then, obviously, leading into the Levi game, we will call it, which is uh, <laughs> happened on Sunday. The Leafs at home versus London, 5-4. The losing pitcher on the London side was Jared Lund, who we will get oh, to that Lundy. chant that we made to about this guy. <laughs> the winning pitcher was actually surprisingly Deska. Deska took the win. Our boy Salazo with the save, which we'll also get to in a second. And I just want to give a quick side note to the boys. There was an umpire who was announced before the game with the last name Brownlee. And now we're well aware there's a Cleveland Brownlee on London. So we were concerned. Are these guys related? Are we going to get calls? 
It was actually a different spelling, Brownlee. So I don't know if that, uh, that, okay. that settles. Uh, if that, that might have been. That might have yeah, been. They might have just done it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but boys, what did what did you think? What did you think of the game, man? Five right. four. Like obviously, Ray, I, he was dealing with something. I need a full recap. I need. I'll, a full I'll say recap. this: if that <laughs> Brownlee um was related to Cleveland Brownlee then he is not a fan of him because four Ks, Golden Sombrero for Cleveland. I love the guy. Those were some tough guts. Elliot That's is wild. right. Five at-bats for Cleveland Brownlee, and he was catching nothing but air, got four straight Ks, and then he almost had the Platinum Sombrero. He grounded out on his fifth. Anybody, yeah, well, go, uh, anybody go yard from London at the pits or – uh, no, uh, I actually, think. actually, uh, I don't think anyone went yard, but McQueen, who we chirped, went four for five. But if you also remember, he ran into that epic double play turned by Tamani. That was also a key moment at the top of the third that led to the bottom of the third when our boy Mara gave it to you with another big boy blast. Where'd he go? Into the little league field again or what? Oh, yeah. Straight it was like one. right center. Yeah, it was. It was a beauty. It was a beautiful. Yeah. yeah, to give to give the like a quick recap for Ray. It was it was basically all pitching for Toronto. Cacados came in for four the innings. Workhorse again, and he oh, crushed yeah. it. He had like eight Ks in four yeah. innings. Yeah. Then Deska came in and did a good four, another three or so innings. Three, three. I think he had yeah. three, no, three another, which is which is long yeah. for Deska. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cacados no, went four innings. Oh my God, just he went four innings, two earned runs with eight Ks. Yeah, Deska came in with three innings pitch, gave up only two hits. He had another four Ks. Deska's been yeah. fucking dealing, boys. And then Kyle Love. came in and had a tough go. <laughs> he 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 was he said he was supposed to be on emergency uh, call up. Yeah. They, they threw yeah. him in there. He, Kyle, we it, respect you. He came up to the bush yeah. after the game, and he was like, "Boys, my bad." And we're like, "Dude, it's all good, man." Dude. <laughs> no, we respect no, really? you, Kyle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he was yeah. just like, because I wasn't sure. Things. We're like. We're like, yo, you want a beer? He's like, no. And he just kind of hung. And then he's like, my bad, guys. <laughs> like, Dude, it's but all good, man. I'll like, say this. Is he a new guy? Is he a new stuff. guy? Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. I'll say this, though, for Kyle. Uh, you know what? Any game where if your pitching doesn't lead to the loss, and even if it does, we will support you, bud. We love it. Love the fact that you came up and said hello. That's amazing. Yes. That's amazing. Respect. And then we'd be remiss, obviously, not to mention, Ray, so, you know, the game's going on. The bases are juiced. No out. London up to bat. Uh, Kyle Who goes out. Go Immediately, Lazo walks up to the mound. Bagels, another one of the Bushmen, shout out Bagels, immediately <laughs> calls it. He goes, Lazo's going in. And we're like, no fucking way. He starts untaping his wrist and he starts it. warming up. I love it. Dude, he fucking gets out of a bases loaded jam. No, no run yeah. score. And That's no amazing. The double yeah, play gets turned by Tamani. Then oh he K's God. the next guy. <laughs> inning over. Welcome <laughs> to the world, Levi. What's up? Oh Dude, my God. And he that took like so five awesome. warm up pitches. He just like, hey, I'm good. Right. <laughs> let's go. Yeah. And then he obviously studies in the art of Merrick Deska pitching because yeah. he took like two seconds between throws. Yeah. You just get it back with a quick little. Conductive fireball, the straight Conductive. express, the suit lookout. Yeah. Like, That's amazing. Uh, I can only imagine how fired up the bush was no. after that. It must have been and then the pitching on uh, London's side, he had the, this first guy up, and he just liked to wiggle his hips a lot. Oh, just like Jessica, a hip Jessica, Jessica. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, Hayden. <laughs> Hayden Jacko. Hayden Jacko. Five innings pitched. Three earn run, four walk, and two K. And what I'll say is he was like dialed in for the first two innings. Yeah. And all of a sudden, you know, he's doing this hip waggle before he'd pitch. Elliot started like chanting Shakira at this guy. We threw on the Shakira song in between innings, and he immediately <laughs> melted down. <laughs> so we came back, and then came in uh, Lund, who was their other relief pitcher. 
three innings pitch, two earn run, two walk. But our, we developed a new chant that we think we're going to be using a lot more in the pits. And, you know, Lund was having a tough time. The errors were happening behind him. So we started the old Beatles track. Oh, we are saying <laughs> is give Lund a chance. <laughs> no, we stuck, we stuck with Lundy. Because we oh, yeah, Lundy. Lund. Oh, I compared him Lundy. to a sport fishing boat earlier in the day because Lund is a wonderful sport fishing boat. Oh, and our own oh, fisherman, man. Jeff McLeod, appreciated it greatly. So, Lundy. That's awesome. That's amazing. Great, homie. That's amazing. Awesome. And also another news and notes of the day, shout out Heavy T's grandfather, yes. Grandpa T with the comeback, shows up with that blazing lens on his Nikon with oranges for the boys, hooks them up. Grandpa T, we love you. Grandma T, we also oh. love you. Ray nice. still has the pictures. <laughs> there that. we have it from last Whoa. year. He's got some Side, good ones. That stays on. That stays on the fridge. Yeah. I got Any my grandpa side note, picture immediately goes on the fridge. Side note Here's about issues. Grandpa T. Not only did he bring us uh, tangerines or clementines, but he wrote on the Bissell margarine container for the Bushman from <laughs> Grandpa T. <laughs> Yo, I still have the tangerine yeah, container. You <laughs> Gee, you better hold on to that because you know they're going to ask for it back, man. Oh, Elderly yeah. people love to reuse containers. Yeah. <laughs> it's always the vessel. The vessel margarine <laughs> container. For sure, for sure. It's always used. Yeah, yeah, so, so my question is, was it, was it Grandpa T peeling those or did Grandma T be like, no, we need to bring oranges for the boys or clementines for the boys. They're expecting it now. <laughs> oh, Whatever it, it was, we love you. And you know, we all I wouldn't hate some cookies. <laughs> we also love shout out Scott Mitchell from TSN. We saw him tweeting. He was at the Christie Pitts game about a week or so ago, checking out the game. We gave him a shout out. Scotty, we see you. We know you're covering the Jays, but come up to have a beer in the bush anytime. Or come on the podcast. I was great. Great. Scotty I Mitch up here. <laughs> that was another him. epic game too. The Leafs are look they're looking oh, pretty good at home. Do you guys want some scores from around the league? Yeah. 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 Hell yeah. yeah. League roundup. There okay, some, here we go. Uh, give me some like give me some like sound effects. All right, all right. All right. All right. All right. Hey, welcome. All right. So on Friday, the 16th of July, we had Kitchener at London, rain out. Oh, then we man. had Barry at Brantford. Let how about you guys guess how this one turned out? Yeah, Brantford took the L. 9-5 by Barry. Grad Grievenson with the Hey, win. they were five. up 5 nothing. They oh. were up 5 nothing for most of the game. And then, and then just, there was a crumble that happened. Oh, and was, it was it a hot night? That's it. That's yeah. it. Was it a hot nine? And that was it. So for Saturday. I think it was a hot nine. I think it was a quick. It's like a quick oh, yeah, five and it. then a quick four. Yeah. <laughs> on Saturday yeah. we had uh, was Barry nice. Barry at Welland. Yeah, that got rained out. It's swampy in Southern oh, Ontario yeah. right now. God. Then we had Kitchener in London. Kitchener's first game back into the league. They get shut out five zip. You know who the winning pitcher was for London? The the trader, Pedro Dolo oh. Santos, goes eight Jeez. innings, zero earned runs. What a beast. I Pedro, know, I we do love it. you, but we would have loved you. We would have loved you. You know here. we're going to be calling him Pedro Los Santos. <laughs> oh, yeah, for He's sure. taking those L's. For sure. <laughs> so then Sunday, we had Kitchener. You know, they were licking their wounds, went back home, and they beat Welland 18-7 to on their home opener. It was – and, and, and I'll, I'll have you know, the starter for Welland was our boy Brett Lawson, a.k.a. Eric Hegadoran took one innings pitch, <laughs> took seven runs in an inning and a third. But like the Frontier League may be calling you back, and I don't even know if they want you. Like this is. Wow, I mean, start. the craziest thing too is it was just announced today that Welland had actually signed Brett Lawson after getting him in the dispersal draft with the Guelph players. So they were probably like, oh, why do we have Hagen Doran here? They called him Lawson. Let's just get Lawson. Let's get Lawson. <laughs> <laughs> and then to wrap up on Sunday, we had 
Bradford bringing home their first victory of the season, 7-5 over Hamilton. So good to see you guys Love get it. off the schneid. Yeah. Love this. it. Say over who? Hamilton? Yep. Hamilton. Over yeah, what, what's the Leafs schedule like looking this week? We got Barry uh, so on Wednesday. This week, exactly, Ray. Wednesday, 730, mm-hmm. Dominico Park. We got the Kitty Cats, the Barry Bay Cats coming into town to play the Leafs. Can't wait. Uh Ray, is it, will you be there for the rest of the year? Like, I think no. you might be tied up. <laughs> I'm going to try and squeak over for an inning or two just to get a couple <laughs> cheers in. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. That'd be hilarious. Um, quick recap of the standings, boys. So, as is through, mostly, most teams have played five games. London sitting top of the leaderboard. They're four and one. Yeah, we gave you your first and only loss. What's up? They have a plus 33 run differential, scored 44, only took home 11. Barry's in second at two and one. They're plus eight with the run differential. Toronto, three and two. We're in third, boys, plus three. 39 4, 36 against. We have the high scoring game. But it's also 38 runs in three home games, one run in two away games. So we're due on the road. That number's yeah. gonna rise. Uh, no, our bats, our right. bats are, our bats are starting to catch up. I have no doubt yeah. about our offense this year. It's unreal. Fourth place, Kitchener, one and one. They're a plus six. Hamilton, they're in fifth, two and three, with a dash eight, twenty four, thirty two. Our boys, Ryan, we love you, man. But Wellens like put taking some runs against. They're two and three with the league worst minus twenty seven. They have 34 runs scored four, which is like third in the league, but 61. 61? Oh, just oh, a tough, tough one. And then Hager's favorite, Hager's favorite team, the Red Sox, coming in at seven. <laughs> picked up their first win, one and four. They're minus 15 with 23, four, and 38 against. Poor Bradford. I mean, they, you know, they, like, I think they're going to get more wins this year oh, than yeah. they did last year. I'm feeling it. We're just giving them a hard time. Just, we love it. Ends in Brantford. We've been there many a time. They've supported. Oh, it's them a great first. stadium. I great. love the yeah. stadium. Arthur Ar- Anderson Stadium, I believe it is. Um, yeah. So I don't know, boys. Anything else to jam on? I have a few more stats. You want to know some like lead leaguers? Yeah. Like, what do you want? Okay. Yeah, we want lead, some lead leaguers. Lead leaguers. How many lead <laughs> leaguers you got? How many lead <laughs> leaguers? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, you're drinking the fancy stuff now, eh? The All right. Actually, you know what? I want to touch on one thing. Yes. Is our boy Fernsey over there with was it Welland or Hamilton? Hamilton. Hamilton, yeah. Hamilton, yeah. All he, over the field. Ter- he had a tough game in the pits, but then he was also for some so reason So to give people content, Asher. the shortstop for Hamilton, Burnside, I think is his last name, Burnsy. Go on. Anyways, <laughs> he's got number 55. He's playing short, so the number of an error for a shortstop is E5. and He had two fives, so obviously he made two terrible errors. <laughs> <laughs> but he was for some reason playing catcher when I believe – they gave up an inside the park home run or no inside the infield home run to uh, <laughs> London. Was it? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> what happened on that play? Ray, I know you follow like the points. Tree. I have Ray no Jones. idea. God damn it. I can't. Dude, he's had a big week. week. Ray is at a big wild. week. <laughs> it was wild. <laughs> and then I think he all. even pitched <clears throat> a game also after playing that catcher as well. This guy's all over the place. All over and the in place. no and in no good way in any of the places yeah. he's all over to. <laughs> he's having a tough season. We love you, Bernsey, but you're gonna love catch you. him from the boys. Love you. Love you. Um, yeah, so some lead leaguer, leader, leaguers. Wow, geez, <laughs> spell will you? Wow. Uh, so for hitting Riley, a respectable sixth in the league, he's batting 455 and he's sixth in the league. Like, put that together. Jake Wilson one? in yeah. Barry is batting 667. How many at bats? How many games? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They've only played one game. They've only played two games. They've played two games. They're one and one. One and one. Uh, Home runs. We got Cal Brazier with three from Hamilton. And then we got, Uh, of course, with two. 
and uh, Mara with two. Or was there a game update, Ray? Do you got a live game update? Oh, no, no. Sorry, Carrie was just asking me what time it was. What so. <laughs> <laughs> time is it? We have a son. <laughs> Why are you not in bed with me? <laughs> that, might, that might be, yeah. Maybe that's a cue to wrap it up then, eh? <laughs> no, no, no. It's all good. <laughs> Uh, honestly he's so yeah. chill i can't even believe it nice dude you're, that's he, congratulations to you he's got ibl that's bush amazing. blood in him already so it's great it's gonna start heckling you you're gonna be like making dinner he's just gonna start giving it to you oh yeah for sure <laughs> what position <laughs> what these, position he's gonna play i don't know i'm kind of feeling like shortstop maybe oh. maybe third base i'm liking dude. that hot corner that hot corner that then we can corner. stay on him dude, too. dude sure. now with with your height and carrie's height he's a pitcher or an outfielder i like that I like actually that. that's a good point actually cam you know how you like you when yeah, we i want the lanky own, guy you wanted the tall and lanky now we're pitcher? gonna get he one is 55 Ray. centimeters long it's long he's longer <laughs> than the average baby they said <laughs> Ray, that is a long baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's that's so good. IBL pitcher. I love it. I love it. That's amazing. Oh, man. Nice. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. But, you know, we got Lazo in second in home runs with Mara. And we also got Lotto leading the league in RBI with nine. <laughs> Riley nice. sitting second with eight. Mara's got six in third. Like, there's Leafs all over. And Dolo Santos is actually leading the league in uh, in wins with two. Two London guys have two, obviously four and four and one. Wow. Maddie K's got one. And then K's, Maddie is second in the league. Maddie Cacatos, that is. 15 like K's. Dude, he's looking uh, good this year. He's looking he's good. He's dialed in. We're loving it. We're loving the effort. And uh, I just think, you know, obviously we're going to try and drop these every week. Uh, people come out to the games Tuesday or Sundays at 2 p.m. and our Wednesdays usually at 7:30. Domenico Field. Check the Bushman at thebushman.ca at the Bushman number one on uh, Insta and uh, on, on Twitter. And I don't know what are the what else you guys got to say. I love it. That's and perfect. And also, just in case they're not aware, you should also watch Bush Banter. Just in yes. case you weren't aware, that's a thing. <laughs> Watching it now. <laughs> Hello. Cheers, boys. That's awesome. Great. Salute Guys, to yeah. you and Carrie. To you and Thank Carrie. you. We're going to try and squeak yeah, over there man. for an inning or something tomorrow. So hopefully I can see you guys. Oh, man. All right, brother. <laughs> All right, guys. Good luck. That's awesome. <laughs> Later, boys. Later.